Y'all, welcome back to my channel. It's really, really windy. Um, this is another vlog. Hopefully I post this because I've been starting vlogs and not finishing them. But we're going to Orange Theory. I'm late per usual. I'm trying to get a good Saturday morning workout in. It's a 90 minute class, so. And the music will be jumping in there, so I'll be having a good time. But into the vlog, y'all. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe down below. I'm hopping and puffing before I even walk into class, but I'm gonna do it. Okay, see y'all in a second. Hey girls, I had about three drinks. I'm a little right now, but the girls from Orange Theory are very cute, very cool. We're just hanging out at this bar. This is what I wore to class. This tank top. We have the jacket on. I always have a crossbody. And then I love these little tights from uh, Fenty. And then I have like some biker shorts underneath. So you know, we can tuck in things. But get into it, y'all. Let me, let me zoom in. Period. It's a cute little Saturday vibe. <laughs> Period. Hey y'all, I am back home. <laughs> anyway, ciao. Um, it was very, very lit. It was nice to talk with girls that I go to class with. I see all the time. We just be working out, but we don't really be getting connecting. So it was nice to go and do a little bar. I had some drinks and I'm gonna get in the shower and freshen up a little bit because we're gonna go to this club. But it's like an outside patio type vibe. It's not like nightclub because it's like literally like, what time is it? I keep saying that. Like, it's like four o'clock. So we're gonna keep a little four to seven, a little chill vibe. So I'm gonna put a little sign in nothing too major, whatever. And we're gonna keep the weekend pushing because we're having a good time. No plans. Just vibes. <laughs> Hi, I am at this bar or whatever, and I'm lit. Hold on. You got it? Yeah. <laughs> Get into the food, y'all. Oh my god. I'm so hungry. Let me get my drink in there. Period. Period. I'm so hungry, y'all. Hey, y'all. It is the next day. Um, sorry this vlog is short and all over the place, but I'm trying to get something out because the other one content and I don't be filming or vlogging all the time because I just be all over the place sometimes or I'm just home and don't go nowhere. So, like, but anyways, y'all, yesterday was so much fun. Orange Theory was fun. Then we went to this bar. I had some drinks and then came back, had a quick change. And then we went to another bar, had fun. And at that point, I was like, I gotta call it a night. So I came home. I had the Little Caesars Crazy Puffs. When I tell you those things are so good, I, I think it may depend on where you get them and like how they make them. Cause like some put more like the garlic butter that really like is the, on the top is the chef's kiss, like the, it makes everything and if you have to like get it uber eats or whatever like it's gonna be cold so you're gonna pop it in the air fryer but like fresh from little caesars and if you don't like little caesars okay so much silence but anyways child you know what i mean so that was yesterday and then i started watching real housewives of salt lake city because my friend had been watching it for forever and i was like oh whatever 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 and then this girl, Monica, that's on the show is coming to the bar that I went to yesterday, but next weekend, I'll probably vlog that, we'll see. Um, and she's like hosting the night and there's drag and everything and I don't know her, so I'm trying to catch up a little bit so I can know at least the front series, the Salt Lake City part of Real Housewives. I don't even think she's on the first season, um, so I don't even know if I'll get to see her, but it's what it is. And it's really good, it's juicy, it's giving more um to watch than Atlanta or Potomac has been like the past couple seasons which is embarrassing but it's, it is what it is um girl 
Miss Mary. <laughs> Miss Mary, I ain't gonna play about Miss Mary. Um, I like her. Um, I like Lisa. She's good fun. And I've also seen Whitney and um, Heather on Real Housewives Ultimate Girls Trip Thailand. So I know a little bit more about them. Um, and I like them too. I, I like, it's a good cast. It's a good cast. Everything's flowing. There's drama. Uh, I like it. It's making me want to go visit Salt Lake City because it's not that far from Denver. And I've never been to Utah, so... I don't know. I just want to saw some Mormons and mountains and stuff. That's all I know. But anyways, child. So that was that. Um, today, I am going to go to the thrift store. Thrift store. Oh, girl, I got some little fly fleas, whatever, child. Not fleas. I ain't got no fleas. Uh, <laughs> the little fruit flies. They gotta go. But I'm about to go to this thrift store called Ark that my uh, friend from Orange Theory told me about. So I'm gonna see if I can find anything to wear for the Salt Lake City event that's coming up. It's very nightclub, but I wanna do something that I don't have. You know, I just, I'm itching for something cute and thrift shopping is like cute as well. Um, I don't wanna spend a lot of money. And I've been to a, like Goodwill here and a few vintage shops, so I think it was my mistake because they were expensive. Like 40, 50, 60 dollars for things. And I'm like, that's not how it's supposed to be. So I think I need to go to a thrift, thrift shop, not a vintage store. I think that's the difference. So I'm gonna do that. I'm probably going on another hot girl walk. I love a good walk. It's supposed to snow tonight, so I'm gonna try and get it in like now. And then I gotta get a few groceries. I'm trying to really, really, really hone in on my eating out. Uh, besides Little Caesars, I haven't ate out in at the bar like yesterday. So besides yesterday, I haven't ate out all week, which is really, really good for me because I was eating out every single day which was a problem and running up a tab on my card and my check, okay? When I started, I started doing a budget because I'm trying to be a little bit more financially conscious and I looked at how much money I was spending on food and I said, ain't no way, ain't no way. So we had to nix that. And uh, work has been a little wild the past month, honestly. So I've been working out, so I gained a little bit of weight, but the difference is with the hormones, girl, it's all in the right places. It's a little bit in the mid section, but it's really in the hips and thighs, and I can really see the difference. And there's nothing wrong with that, but I just want to get back to my, what I was about a month, a month and a half ago, because I'm about to go to Mexico, and I ain't gonna have no clothes on. So, what about it? Yeah. So, and then, so yeah. Thrift shore. Th why do I keep saying shore? Thrift store. Walk. Groceries. I think that's the plan. I don't know what is beeping, but they need to stop. Let me show you all the outfit and then we're gonna head out. So this is the outfit of the day. I don't really do like street, casual, whatever you call this, but I just wanted to do something a little different. I got my black New Balances on, some jeans, this Rugrats uh, jersey that I've had for a while, but it's shaping the body nicely, I think so. Um, and then the same crossbody, a little jacket because it's a little cold. Um, I give it like a mm, seven out of ten. The jacket jersey ratio isn't exactly right, but it's doing the job, I think. And then I got my bags for a little groceries or whatever, what, what I happen to get down there. So, mm, excuse me, y'all. Let's go get this Saturday, not Saturday, girl. Let's go get this Sunday started. Girl, what is going on? Um, y'all, I don't know. I'm gonna give it a try though, but I don't know. Oh y'all, I have made it out and it was it was pretty good, I'm not gonna lie. It was better than the Goodwills that I've been to before as far as like variety of stuff. Like it wasn't out of this wazoo world. Out of, out of the wazoo, whatever the phrase is. But it was cute. I don't like basic, like, grandma, like, if you're from Florida, like, Bells, um, Belk, like, that type of stuff was a lot of thrift store vibes. And that's a lot of what I saw. But thankfully, there was people like me who have a little bit of a different style that brought clothes there. So, I spent $48. And let me show y'all what I got. So, firstly, this is very different for me. Look at this purse, though. It's so cute and funky. I would... It's a statement piece, so, like, I would have to find the right outfit to wear it with. But 
It's cute. It's cute. It's cute. It's cute. It's cute. And then I also got this Calvin Klein sweater. It's like sheep, whatever, cloud, something. I don't know, chow. But it's so cute. Look at this. Pretty, 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 pretty. Even though wintertime is like ending, I still saw some stuff that was cute. This is cute. It's giving very much like going to like a bar for dinner or something. It's this crop top sweater situation, but it's like frayed. It's hard to show in the camera. Um, I would wear it with all black, of course, but just to not wear all black and do something else. I got a couple shirts for work this summer. Very office vibes. Just a cute little lavender lilac polo. And then this like tri-colored long sleeve. I think it's very cute. It's really going to slay. Oh, I didn't even notice the collar is like popping up. I'm going to have to iron this down or take it somewhere. But very cute, very cute, very cute. And then you all, I got some see-through stuff. I'm surprised they had this. This is very cute, very me, very going out to the club. I have one of these, but it's long sleeve, and I don't have one that's short sleeve, so I can just tuck it into whatever I'm wearing and put on nipple covers. Boom, bada, boom, bada, boom. And then another one. This is what I think that I'm wearing next weekend. I've always wanted, I've never done like the Michelangelo, Michelangelo, like art piece kind of vibe. It's a crop top um, that I might wear with the skirt that I have, and then i think it'll be a look so that's all the pieces or those are all the pieces that i got nothing really goes together at all um but it's a lot of different things i think will help diversify my closet and especially since i just got rid of a lot of stuff um i did some spring cleaning i don't know if i vlogged that a couple weeks ago or about a month ago or two months ago whatever it was so i did it but I'm here at this little lake that was close by. I got scared for a second because there's like a bunch of men's is playing soccer or whatever. And this area that I'm at is very Hispanic. Like 95% of people that I've seen are, are Hispanic. Other 5% are white, of course. I have seen no black people over here. So I just don't want to drive to another area because it's going to snow a little bit later. So I'm going to do a walk or two around this little loop and I'll show y'all. And then I'm going to head back to the house because, um, yeah, I'm going to do that. But I thought it was kids at first and then I pulled up and I was like, no, these are grown men's. And they fine, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> they fine and i'm gonna be walking over there because there was already men staring at me in the thrift store and it's just awkward and i ain't got time for all that so yeah and i look cute or whatever and i'm black like out of all these people and i got the hair and i i'm not gonna go on this over and over and again but i stick out like a sore thumb pretty much wherever i go and i'm used to that and that's totally fine um and I'm very hyper aware of it now that I've been working from home, at least aside from the summer. And when I come outside, like, I'm just so much more sensitive to the environment, the people around me, people's reactions, people's, like, sensing people. And I just feel everything. Like, I can tell. So, that's why it generally takes a lot for me to even go outside because it's a, it's overwhelming in a sense, like... To have that stark difference of being at home all the time and then coming outside. And then not just coming outside and being, you know, like, regular, regular. Being outside and, like, everybody's staring at you. So, that's that. Oh, he's cute, too. There's a lot of cute men over here, too. I'm over by Alameda, 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 somebody avenue. If you know Denver, that's where I'm at over here. So, I'm going to do this little walk and stop. And then, ooh, ooh, he is fine. Okay, let me stop. <laughs> <laughs> bye y'all, bye y'all. Look at this, y'all. A lot of places I've been, I've been so crowded. And this is nice and peaceful. I don't know, because the sun's not out or just the area. But I love a good walk and see the water. And then when I get on the other side, I'll probably show y'all the mountain view. Very peaceful. Y'all get into it. Uh, the water and then the mountains in the backdrop is just so pretty. This is a nice, quiet little park. 
Y'all, I've never played pickleball, but people are just obsessed. Sorry, my walking is wild. Um, Y'all see who in there, though. But anyways, she... It looks cute or whatever. It's a lot of hitting and running. I just like to walk and look cute. But I don't know. Maybe one day I'll try it. Well, y'all, this is why I don't be vlogging because I'm back in the bed and I'm finna stay here for the rest of the night. So this is probably where we're ending the vlog. Ugh, I have this pimple here. I haven't got a pimple in so long. I'm gonna put a pimple patch on it tonight and see if it gets rid of it. Otherwise, I'll pop it. I've been trying to be really good about not popping them because then it gets scars and blah, 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 blah. I'm not gonna get into all that. But anyways, y'all, I'm gonna watch Salt Lake City. I'll show y'all the clothes. I didn't go to the grocery store because I don't feel like I'm gonna just do it later in the week. And I already got food that I can eat for tonight. So, y'all, yeah, yeah, this was this vlog. Not much, like I said, but just something to post. And I got a lot of trips coming up next month. So, I'll be getting videos out. Yeah. So, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below, like I said, y'all. And I love y'all. See y'all in the next one. Bye.